let's talk about noise pollution now in india we have the noise regulation rules that have come up i believe a lot of you might not have heard about it but yes this is very very important for your examination perspective now section 2a of the air prevention and control of pollution act 1981 has included noise as under the definition of pollutants now when we talk about the permissible limits for the industrial area during the day time it's 75 decibel so decibel is the unit which we uh, use to measure the noise and industrial it's 75 during the day time commercial it's 65 residential 55 and silent zone you have 50 decibels during the day time and during the night time it's uh, 40 decibels so th there is a kind of difference of 10 in each of these and difference of 5 in the case of industrial regions because industries some of them work during the night as well so that's one of the things that we need to understand now noise pollution control rules for 2000 were part of the environment Mental Protection Act 1996 that were released. The idea is to differentiate the region under four categories: industrial region, commercial region, residential region, and a silent zone. Now, silent zones are considered in not less than uh, 100 meter areas around the hospitals or the educational institutions that could be seen. And government would have the responsibility to notify. The state would have the responsibility to notify the silent zones. also we are talking about the implications of this noise on the health so that's one of our major concerns let's say there is lots of horns or lots of uh, noises that are there if there is a dj playing you have a time duration let, let's say by 10 pm uh, beyond 10 pm those are not permissible in most of the cities now this noise stress is important a uh, stress which is caused by a sound of 80 decibel or more affects not only the hearing but also affects the breathing and the thinking process similarly if the noise is beyond 120 decibels it is considered uh, leading to biochemical cycle or affecting the biochemical cycle in a human body uh, it can lead to cholesterol it can lead to high blood pressure problems and who reporting has indicated a interesting fact which says is that nearly 750 million dollars are spent globally because of the hearing losses that are there now these losses indeed have affected the working capability of an individual so most important thing from this section that we can bring about is the levels of uh, the noise levels permissible in india for the residential uh, the industrial and the silent zone also we are talking about understanding the four criteria so industrial residential commercial and silent zone so those are some of the most important things that we can check out from this session very very important for your mcq perspective we'll be coming up with many more sessions stay subscribed have a wonderful day ahead